Why does it hurt so bad? So bad. To lose something I never had. apologize if my car is shaky if i look like really dark i'm not sure what's going on with my camera but it's actually it's actually annoying i went to starbucks and i got me a pinkity no this isn't a pinkity drinkity this is actually a dragon drink and it's kind of like another version of the pink drink but it's actually really good and then i got this turkey cheese little sandwich thing this is actually my first time trying this so hopefully it's good It's good. It's good. Mm. Today is currently Friday, August 25th. Six days until my freaking birthday. Basically, this video is just going to be me getting my life together, me getting my stuff together, me going to all of my appointments because I'm going to be going on a cruise for my birthday and I'm really, really excited. We're going to be going to Cozumel, Mexico, which I've actually been to before and I've actually been on this cruise before, but I just wanted to go again because the cruise is actually really fun and I haven't been in a couple of years, so I'm just really excited to go, but um, yeah, basically this is just gonna be like a prep for vacation i'm gonna be doing my nails i'm gonna be getting my hair done lashes toes wax eyebrows what else did i have to do i think that's pretty much all i'm gonna be getting done as far as maintenance and then i also want to do a little bit of shopping because i have to get some luggage because i don't have anything to pack all of my stuff in and i'm also waiting on my shein cart to come in so whenever that does come in i may show y'all like a couple of the pieces that i'm gonna be wearing i actually haven't decided if I'm going to be vlogging this trip because I remember the last trip I ended up vlogging and it kind of stressed me out. I enjoyed the vacation but I didn't really get to enjoy the vacation so I'm not sure if I'm going to be vlogging but if I do y'all will see. Yeah that's basically what's going to be happening in today's video but right now I'm actually at the beauty salon and I'm about to soak my nails off because in a couple of days I'm probably going to end up doing them but I just want to go ahead and soak them off so that when I actually actually do my nails this won't be as time consuming as it normally is and then my mom is actually probably going to do my hair because I have some bundles coming in today it's gonna to be deep wave hair actually let me show y'all the hairstyle that I'm gonna be getting I'm basically gonna be getting the Fulani braids with the sewing at the back I'm using my iPad right now because my phone is currently broken i'm gonna insert a picture of how i'm gonna end up getting it i have to kind of look for the exact style that i want but i am gonna be getting like the fulani hairstyle and i'm really excited for that i actually have one more client that i have to do before i do all of this so i'm gonna go ahead and do her nails and then i'll catch up with you guys whenever we get some stuff done <laughs> She can get a condition on this dry. Yeah. <laughs> she getting one shampoo because she don't pay, so one shampoo. Baby, it ain't even her birthday yet. My nails better be so fine. <laughs> Let me do this real quick. I want a nice little shampoo. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> She get a deep conditioning treatment since it's her birthday. I'm gonna be blow dry her hair. Just snap the head a little girl. Yeah, I look like 
is like, she think it's all of that. Come back to y'all when I finish doing this nappy headed girl hair. <laughs> I am trying to get my hair done. You tired? I should. After doing all of that. Can you put your hand to do? I am done with my wax appointment. I actually got my eyebrows and my Brazilian wax at the same place. And I actually like kind of like my eyebrows. They're a little bit thinner than I thought they were going to be. So it's kind of like, eh. I actually like the laminated brow look. So I'll probably just use a spoolie and just brush them out to give like that laminated look. And also to make them appear a little bit thicker because I like my thick brows. But these are actually really cute. Like, she did them really nice. I just, this is not something I'm used to. I also ended up going to a different wax lady because my initial wax lady actually went up on her prices. And if I'm just being honest with myself, I couldn't afford it. So, I ended up going to a different wax bar, which I actually really like. I'm glad we got that out the way because that's probably, like, the hardest part of this whole maintenance vlog. I'm actually at Sally's right now because I want to pick up a couple of things for my nails. I ran out of a couple of my supplies and I'm just going to be restocking on them. I also forgot to mention to you guys that my hair is not finished. She did the first, like the top braids, but she didn't sew the hair in in the back because the hair didn't come in in time. It was supposed to come in yesterday and it was supposed to be delivered to the beauty shop, but it didn't end up coming in time. So hopefully it comes today so I can go ahead and get the hair put in my head because it's going to be so freaking cute. I'm not sure what else I have planned for the day. I think I'm just going to get these nails done.
the day that I'm going to be getting my lashes done. As y'all can see, I have this little scarf on. Basically, that just means I did it. I never got my hair finished. I was supposed to get it finished yesterday, but the hair never came in. It was supposed to come two days ago. So I'm really hoping that comes in before the trip because if it doesn't come in, then I'm just gonna be looking stupid. And then my Shein cart also hasn't arrived yet. If my clothes do not come in, then we're gonna have a serious problem, like a serious problem. It's, the problem is gonna be very, very serious. Right now, I'm on my way to my lash appointment and I'm literally, I'm already late. I'm supposed to be there for nine and it's currently 9.08, but I don't have a phone. So I literally had to like try to figure out how to get here without my phone. Normally I can use my iPad to go somewhere, but it's saying that it doesn't have any service, which I don't have data on the iPad. So it makes sense. But the last time I used it, I turned the maps on before I left the house. So it ended up working, but this time it just didn't work like that. So unfortunately I just had to figure out how to get here. But I'm almost there. I'm probably gonna be just five minutes late because it's literally right here. I hate being late. And then she's probably texting me, or she's probably texting me, and I don't have my phone, so I'm just looking stupid. I have so much going on. I low key just ran a real light, but we're not gonna talk about that. Hey, can I get the PB Swizzle? PB Swizzle, do you think it's for you? That'll be all. Alright, it's all going to be tough to see Okay. I look so freaking good, like. I look so good. I look so good, like. I'm sorry, you cannot tell me anything. When I get these bundles put in my hair, you're really not going to be able to tell me anything at all. So, just beware. PB Swizzle? Um, yes. Thank you. Thank you. And here's your spoon. Have a good day. You too. Ooh. We got us a smoothie bowl. I'm so ready to tear this up. I'm so ready to tear this up. Like, you don't even know. Like, girl. Like, oh, purr. Like, you ain't think. Oh. oh. We're finally back at the house. I'm in this weird position because my bed is currently on the floor in the living room. Last night, me and my boyfriend did a little cooking and movie night in here, but we got our PB Swizzle smoothie bowl. I'm hoping that this is good because, you know, different smoothie kings make it differently, and I went to a different smoothie king today, so let's do a little taste test. Okay, okay. Mm, this is good. I really want to go to like a phone repair place and see if somehow they can repair my phone. It looks horrible, but I'm gonna need a phone. Not necessarily on the actual cruise, but I need a phone to take pictures and stuff. I didn't get to take pictures of my nails. I need to take pictures of my lashes for this thumbnail. I just need to take pictures. And I just been sitting here looking dumb without a phone. And I'm really not like a phone girl. Like I'm not on my phone 24 seven. So it really hasn't felt like anything not having a phone. I've been using my iPad for like little things and I can text a couple of my friends. I'm pretty sure people might have been calling me. I might have gotten phone calls from clients and stuff that don't have iPhones. It hasn't been stressing me out, but I feel like I need a phone for this trip. I'm gonna need to take pictures and stuff. But aside from my lash appointment that I had today, I actually have a couple more errands to run. Then I also have a pedicure appointment today. But before I do that, right now it's 12 o'clock. I think I wanna leave out in the next 30 minutes to go and do some some 
shopping for some luggage because I'm gonna need a bag to pack all of my stuff in. So I'm gonna go and get me like a cute little suitcase or something. And I also need to get like travel essentials and stuff like that. Probably gonna make a stop by Target to get those things. I also actually wanted to go to Target to find like a good book to read because you know of course there's gonna be things to do on the boat and stuff but I'm probably actually gonna wanna like you know sit out in the sun, read me a good book and just relax. So I'm gonna try to find me a cute little romantic novel because those are the books that I typically like to read. I could download a book on my iPad, but I've actually been kind of into collecting books, not even just for the aesthetic. Like I do actually want to read more and kind of expand my vocabulary because I be feeling dumb sometimes, not gonna lie. And there's like the 75 hard challenge that I wanna try where there's a list of things that you have to do, but one of the things on the list is to read a book for at least 10 minutes or read something for at least 10 minutes. And then I think the other things that you have to do throughout the day is basically like work out and stuff like that. It's supposed to improve your lifestyle. We're gonna be doing that pretty soon. I fucks with these crab cakes. Hmm. <sighs> This was scrum deli yum yum. Before we head out, I actually have a package from Merit Beauty. They actually sent me a couple of things that I wanted to test out for you guys. And I also have a partnership with them. I'm actually going to link them in my description below so you guys can check them out. But they're a company that basically sells like beauty products and stuff like that. And they let me pick out a couple of things. So I'm just going to share them with you and let you guys know how they work for me. That is so satisfying. Ooh. This is so freaking cute. They actually gave me like a little makeup bag, which I could potentially take on the trip. Hold on, my camera's about to die. It looks like a little purse. It actually probably could potentially turn into like a little purse, but it's really cute. And this is a cute little makeup bag. Let's see what they sent me. I actually picked out these items myself. They gave me this cute little tinted lip oil. I'm gonna open it and show you guys what it looks like, but this is the packaging. And then they also gave me their instant glow serum. This has 2% niacinamide for brightening. It has four types of hyaluronic acid for deep hydration, caffeine rich, cacao seed extract for plumping, Japanese gold thread root for soothing and antioxidant protection, and it's pH balance for a healthy skin barrier. This is what the packaging looks like, and these are the list of things that it consists of. Let's actually open the glow serum first. Ooh, okay. This is our glow serum. The bottle is so cute and aesthetic. It has their logo right here. This is so cute. To use, shake well, massage two to three pumps onto skin before or after moisturizer in the morning or twice a day. I actually didn't put moisturizer on this morning because I didn't want it to interfere with my lashes. So I'm gonna wash my hands and wipe my face off so that we can put some of this on. Okay, so it says to shake well and massage two to three pumps. It's actually really liquidy, but let's see. It doesn't feel really oily or anything. It just feels like a serum. I don't even know what that's supposed to feel like, but I'm gonna put this on. And then we're gonna go back in with this. Put one pump. I actually really love the whole glow look with, you know, your lash extensions, no makeup, and laminated brows, which my brows actually aren't laminated. They're just naturally straight, so I'm gonna make them have that look too. But it just gives like a whole soft girl look. I actually love this little bottle. It's so cute. We also have another product to try out, which is their lip oil. I love lip oils. Like, I feel like there's a significant difference between lip oil and lip gloss. Lip oil is basically less stickier than the lip gloss this is a lip oil that i picked out even this packaging is so freaking cute let's test it out and see how the texture is oh yeah i absolutely love this we're gonna see how it lasts throughout the day the texture is just perfect it's not too sticky and it's not too loose 
if that makes sense. But those were all of the products that I got from Merit Beauty. Make sure you guys check them out. The link will be in the description below. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the rest of the video. about to go and pick up my little sister i'm gonna take her to get her toes done with me and i guess like after we go and get our toes done i'm gonna do my little shopping she actually doesn't even know i'm going to pick her up so i'm gonna show you guys her reaction when i go and pick her up i'm so good i like you Oh, your fresh is here. Thank you. Hey guys, I miss y'all too. I'm so glad you didn't forget. You thought I was gonna forget. I thought you forgot. I forgot to call you. I thought you had forgot. So I was like, I just asked my mama, can she take me? And I swear, I was just thinking about it. We're going to get our toes done, yes. Bookie. Ooh, I'm so glad you checked me out. But I was like, what? Mm -hmm. My mama gonna check me out. You forgot I was supposed to get you? I thought you forgot. Oh, no. your hair is so <laughs> cute. Her hair is so cute. <coughs> Turn around, let them see. Uh oh, don't play with her. You want to go get Starbucks? Yes, I want to do everything. I want to have this sister day. <laughs> I love your lashes. Thank uh. you. My girl Jolie did them. Make sure y'all go check her out. Mama said your thing was coming in on the 29th. What? Bundles. Oh, yeah. yeah, I said Probably it was coming so. in the 29th. I need to be worried about my Shein package coming in. Oh, man, I like when that shit on you. Yeah. All my bitches pretty rich and thick. Don't think your bitch might. I heard you got a man, but it's all right, mama. Let's go to the mall. I'm about to buy you what you like, mama. We got our ham and Swiss croissant and our dragon drinkity, our pinkity drinkity. This is so cute. I definitely should have got a venti, but that's okay. Oh, I was supposed to be drinking this. Why? Because I got school tomorrow. Girl, it's the middle of the day. Mm. I haven't gave y'all a bite of my food in a little minute, so I guess y'all can get like a little bite. Now that's all y'all getting. Cheers. I'm so silly. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. I forgot to shave my legs, so. I told you. <laughs> so, when they do my toes, they're gonna see my hairy legs. These look like shower caps. We have these two. I think I'm gonna just get this one. I also feel like I need to pick up a couple of body washes just for the house. I think I'm gonna try some new ones. I've been using the Caress and the Dove brand. I think I want to try, hmm, maybe St. Ives, because I've never tried them before. Let's see what this one smells like.
this one smells very similar to the Crest. White peach and orange blossom. I honestly think I'm gonna just stick with this one. Then I also wanted to pick up this coconut coffee because this one smells so good. And I ran out of my last one. I could try like the Olay brand too. This one actually smells really good. successful now we're gonna go in tj maxx and see if i can find some luggage <laughs> tad bit stressed out i probably should be more stressed out than i am but i'm the type of person that doesn't really feed into stress i try to stay as less stressed as possible and just ignore that whole emotion in itself but my Shein cart isn't supposed to come in until september the 1st and we're supposed to be on the boat on august 31st which is my birthday and we leave on august the 30th to go to new orleans i don't know if i told you guys that but that's our current dilemma my Shein package was supposed to be here on the 26th it says it's in los angeles california right now i'm really hoping that it's not i'm hoping that they just haven't updated it yet i'm gonna have to go shopping again and find some new clothes it's just it's just too much most of my maintenance and everything that i need done is basically done the last thing that i have to do for myself is get my hair finished and then i also wanted to pack with you guys i wanted you guys to pack with me get all my stuff together we're gonna clean up tonight and i'm really just going to not really deep clean because honestly i don't need like a deep clean but i'm just gonna clean everything that needs to be cleaned i need to straighten up the kitchen and stuff I need to straighten up the living room a little bit vacuum a little bit stuff like that but i'm not about to sit here and scrub the wall and stuff. We'll save that for another day. <laughs> Officially stressed out. She and count your mother. 
days. Literally my whole trip wardrobe was on Shein. And I'm really upset because that's all my god clothes. Now I literally have to go to the mall and find more clothes with time that I don't have. And it's just honestly annoying. It's pissing me off. I'm trying to be a good spirit about it because I know I'm probably going to find some stuff. But then also now I have to have a budget. And I also need shoes because I don't have enough shoes for this trip. Like I need sandals and that I don't have and it's honestly just so annoying I'm really just over the whole trip like I'm ready to get the trip over with and go back home because this is just for y'all. I'm out here in Miami. Looking for the Uchi daddies. My son need a new peppy. I finally got my hair finished. The hair ended up coming in. It is so freaking cute. I absolutely love it. I'm out here in Miami. Looking for the Uchi daddies. Y'all saw me go to Rainbow and get these clothes. I got four or five different outfits. My total was actually like $53. I was looking all through the clearance rack and I found some cute little things. They're not as cute as my Shein cart, but we're still gonna make it work. I think I'm gonna put together like two more extra outfits because I know there's probably gonna be a day or two where I'm gonna wanna switch outfits. But I'm just gonna do like a little try on because I couldn't actually try anything on. They didn't have any dress room so if the stuff doesn't fit right i can go return it real quick before they close okay so this is the first outfit that i'm trying on i really like this skirt because it's like really colorful you know got the abstract that's really cute and it's like given but the shirt is i don't know maybe it's too small for my boobs because it literally like won't <laughs> go down i don't know maybe you're not supposed to wear a bra with this shirt but i have to wear a bra with every shirt so i'm gonna have to improvise and switch to a different shirt this is another shirt that i have which i say maybe for this i also have this in white too so if all this fails i'll just wear the white one but i don't know what y'all think y'all this next outfit is eating i figured i would actually wear this if i like end up going to a club or something or you know like a little classy night out it's just this oversized button down with like a whole bunch of and it basically just has like a newspaper vibe but it is so freaking cute and then i also paired it with this belt it's just a random belt that i had in my closet figured it'd be cute to like cinch the waist a little bit i love it okay so this is the next little outfit which is basically just a simple like hot pink dress we're actually supposed to go to dinner one night and everybody's supposed to be wearing pink so i guess this is going to be my little pink outfit i feel like it's missing something though maybe like some blinged out shoes or something because this is just it's really cute but it's also like really plain so I'll probably end up wearing like some fancy heels with these just to add a little bit more character to it because it's really cute. It's just simple. Okay, so this next outfit is kind of cute, but I honestly don't know if it's my vibe. I got these shorts that I actually got from Amazon and then this shirt I got from Rainbow today. The shirt is cute, but I don't know if this whole like old school floral thing is my vibe. Like it's cute. I just don't know if I can really rock with it for real.